You may call me Captain Chen Dog. Lovely. Again. <laughs> Guys, how are we doing? We are in Spain. The penultimate round of the World Rally Championship. Matt's with me for the entire weekend. Brilliant stuff. What have we got coming up in the vlog? We've got, obviously, Matt and myself getting up to all sorts of naughties, including that massive boat. In you go, Jules. We will also be crowning, potentially be crowning a world champion. Can or can get the job done this weekend? We'll talk about that in a second. And also, how is a car transformed from gravel to tarmac? So much to catch up on in this vlog. Matt, who do you think is gonna win the championship? Can Oit Tanak do it this weekend? I think Oit Tanak can win the championship, but I don't think he's gonna win it here. Really? Right, let's stop talking. Let's go on a boat, see ya. Right, Matt, just pull that line. Pull it like Matt, go for it. Go, 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 go. Good job. Not bad for a skinny lad. Now we're sailing. So Matt, this isn't bad, is it, eh? The sun is out, just hurt my wrist. We'll start that again. <laughs> <laughs> the boat is back safely. Um, did you enjoy it, mate? Successful trip. I enjoyed the journey. Successful trip. Now, tonight, and it is just getting dark, it's time for the cruise to change from gravel spec to tarmac spec. Ever wondered how it can be done? All this is how. Now, we promised you that we would show you what a rally car looks like when it's transformed from gravel spec to tarmac spec. And joining me, yeah, he's team principal of M Sport, but I don't really see him like that. I see him as my co-driver from going straight sideways. Rich Milner. Say hello, Rich Milner. Who are you? Say hello, Rich Milner. Hello, Rich Milner. Lovely. Big job. Big job. But we have everything prepped to uh, make it less of a big job. Absolutely. Look, and I want to show you this very quickly. The cross members, you've got rear diff, brakes basically there is literally four bolts here one two three four it's pretty simple and it's quite clever really when you think about it the whole back of the car just drops away like that i'm impressed you knew what all them bits were i did ask the boys beforehand because i was unsure a couple <laughs> gearbox obviously yeah. there is a difference between a gravel gearbox and a tarmac gearbox so the gearbox needs changing as well yeah, we can do that in about 20 minutes, so that's no, no drama. It's nuts, isn't it? I mean, a rally car can literally be torn apart and rebuilt in that amount of time. You can see Elvin Evans actually just coming into service now. Three, two, one. Okay, off you go. He has got arms, he's just not doing it. It's been I, brilliant. I glue them like this. It's been to brilliant. try and look important. To look Apparently, important. if you glue exactly. your hands like this, it makes you important. Yeah, that's it. He's just trying to look important. Do you think he's pulling it off? Stick it in the comments below. There you go. That is how a WRC car is transformed from gravel spec to tarmac spec. The mechanics have gone to bed. Tomorrow is a long day. We'll see you then. <laughs> that didn't work, did it? Right, let's try again. Right, I am with an absolute Dakar and KTM legend, Lyosans.
brilliant to have you here in Rally Spain. You were out in the car with Esapeka Lappi earlier. Yeah. What was the experience like? It was crazy, it was really amazing. It surprised me a lot how the car works and how good that is uh, Lappi. Let's uh, talk a little bit about Dakar and preparations. Next time I will see you will be in January. Yeah. Saudi Arabia, it's all very different. This time last year you had a bit of a virus, didn't you? You weren't very well at all. This year you're super fit, you're back, so it's going to be a good year. <laughs> yeah, of course I'm much, much uh, better than, than last year at this time. I feel good, I feel healthy. I just need to, to keep working on the fitness. I'm feeling much better day by day and I hope in January it will be 200%. Legend. Those boys over there, those Toyota boys over there, they're gonna be a little bit nervous, aren't they? I've gotta go and find my commentary box, which is literally actually just here. Matt should be here already, is he? There he is. Say hello, Matthew. Hello, Chen Dog. There he is. Right, let's get commentating. Can Oitanak get this job done? I can't wait, let's go. Now we're going to see what Tanak is doing, but I think he can go faster. That was unbelievable, wasn't it? Oit Tanak is a world champion. Actually, come with me very quickly because we still haven't actually finished filming the end of the Red Bull TV show with him, and there's only one place to do it right here in the Toyota garage. Congratulations, Oit Tanak. You are, mate, a world champion. You couldn't write it. Oit Tanak gets the job done here in Spain with an incredible drive. Listen, to go out and win the power stage and get ahead of Danny Solo and confirm his driver's championship, he is some boy. It's been absolutely brilliant. We hope you've enjoyed the vlog. We've still got one round to go though. We'll see you in Australia. Goodbye.